Have you ever felt like no one believed in you? Or like everyone judged you before they even met you? Emmanuel felt this way when he was younger because everyone judged him since he had a disability. As you can see on the cover of this book, Emmanuel was born with only one leg. But as you read, you'll see he did not let this define him. In Emmanuel's Dream, the true story of Emmanuel of Fosu Yeboah, a truly inspirational story is shared about the main character, Emmanuel, who was born with one leg in Ghana, West Africa, which is the primary setting of this book. Throughout this story, you see how Emmanuel was judged because of his disability. His father left when he was a baby. He was accused of begging when in stores. The other children did not want to play with him. Over time, Emmanuel grew tired of these unprecedented judgments being made about him by others, and he chose to take control over his own life. I want to give you the opportunity to put a face to the story you're hearing, so I'm going to share some pictures I have put together of Emmanuel as an adult. On these slides, you can see pictures of Emmanuel grown up. You can see him with an award. You can see here a picture of him holding a bike. And I've included a picture of a book he wrote that would give you even more insight into his life. This last picture shows you what Emmanuel looks like in the book, and that's a sneak peek to the end. So I don't want to give anything away. I don't want to give away any spoilers. This nonfiction book was written by Laurie and Thompson, illustrated by Sean Qualls, and it was published in 2015. Since the book was published, it has won a Schneider Family Book Award. This means that either the author or illustrator was recognized for portraying the disability experience authentically in children's literature. This shows that this book is appropriate to share with young students because the author and illustrator work together to create an authentic, true portrayal of Emmanuel's life living with a disability. One of the amazing things about this book is that it shows that everyone is capable of achieving great things. One quote from the book that really stood out to me was, being disabled does not mean being unable. And this really shows you what the big picture and the key takeaway is from this book that having a disability doesn't mean that you're unable or lesser than any other person. If you wanna see how Emmanuel proved his community members wrong about individuals with disabilities, you'll have to check this book out yourself because it has quite an exciting ending and I won't spoil it for you. I hope you guys check out this book and I hope you enjoyed.